Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jessica and today I'm gonna be showing you this super quick and easy melt proof summer makeup look. I know especially during the summertime it's difficult to keep your makeup lasting all day. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how I keep my makeup melt proof throughout the summer. So if you wanna see how I got this super easy, fun, sweat proof makeup look, then just keep watching. Okay, so I've been seeing this trend around Instagram lately where people conceal the bottom of their eyebrows before they fill them in. So I'm doing that now. I've already concealed the bottom of my eyebrows with the Anastasia Pro Pencil in Base 1. And now I'm filling in the beginning of my eyebrows with hair-like strokes using Anastasia's Dip Brow Pomade in the shade Ash Brown. And then I'm just gonna fill in the rest of my eyebrows. Now I'm cleaning up the concealer using a Q-tip. I honestly didn't end up liking this method because I think it's harder to get your eyebrows even that way. So I'm just filling in the rest of my eyebrows using the Too Faced Chocolate Brownie Brow Pencil in Dark Brown. And then I'm going to clean up the perimeter of my eyebrows again using the Anastasia Pro Pencil in Base 1. To set my brows, I'm using the Etude House Keep My Brows Fixer. Now I'm priming my eyelids using the Urban Decay Eden Primer Potion. I'm setting that using the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. For my transition shade, I'm using this really bronzy color from the Makeup Revolution Ultra Bronze Palette. For my outer V, I'm using Havana from Anastasia's Contour Kit in Light to Medium. I'm also going to apply Havana to the inner portion of the eyelid. On the center of my eyelids, I'm using the You Light Up My Life Prismatic Highlighter from Too Faced. Moving on to the face, I'm using the Urban Decay D Slick Makeup Setting Spray to prime my face. I feel like this makes my makeup last a lot longer since it's an oil controlling spray. But since primer is the key to melt proof makeup, I'm going to prime a second time. This time I'm using a primer with SPF in it since this is a summer look. And I'm using the Heimish Artless Glow Base. And I want it to look extra glowy, so I'm using the NARS Copacabana Liquid Illuminator over that. Okay, so fun fact, I shut off my camera to go wet my beauty blender, and when I came back, I forgot to hit the record button. So here's me pretending I'm putting on foundation. For foundation, I used a mixture of Maybelline's Dream Liquid Mousse Foundation in Sandy Beige and the NYX Total Control Drops in True Beige. For concealer, I mixed the NYX Total Control Drops in True Beige with the Maybelline Master Conceal Concealer in Light. And of course, I've already baked, but I didn't want to do it again on camera because it would just make my makeup look cakey and powdery. I used the Laura Mercier Translucent powder for that. Now we're going to go back to the eyes. I'm smoking out the bottom lash line with Havana from the Anastasia Contour Kit. For the center of my bottom lash line, I used the Topaz Single Shadow from Anastasia. And then I decided to pop some of that on the upper eyelid as well. I haven't done this in a while, so I decided to apply my falsies underneath my real lashes. The lashes I'm using are the Ilura Lux Baroque lashes. And then I'm going to apply mascara to my bottom lash line. To contour, I'm using Fawn from the Anastasia Contour Kit. For bronzer, I'm using the Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer. This stuff smells so good. This bronzer is pretty light in my opinion. I did get it in the shade bronzer, not light, but it is very light and it's more on the cool toned spectrum of bronzers, so I am using it to contour my nose as well. Now for blush, I'm using the Glossier Cloud Paint in Beam. I'm going to apply this all over my cheeks and I'm also going to bring this over the bridge of my nose and the tip of my nose. 
Now I'm going back in with a butter bronzer and I'm going to apply that to the cheeks. For highlighter, I'm using Summer from the Anastasia Sun Dipped Glow Kit. Now I'm going to moisturize my lips. So I wanted to go for a bold lip with the summer look, but I was feeling pretty indecisive, so I'm going to show you three different lip options. For this first lip option, I'm using the Nude Sticks Intense Matte Lip and Cheek Pencil in Purity to line my lips. And then I'm going to fill them in with the Nude Sticks Intense Matte Lip and Cheek Pencil in Stiletto. I wanted it to be more of a gradient lip, so I'm using the Anastasia Pro Pencil in Base 1 to go over the border of my lips. This is the lip option I ended up liking the most, but I'm going to show you the other two lip options as well. For the second lip option, I'm using the Kiss Cosmetics Matte Liquid Lipstick in Celeste. And then for the third lip option, I'm using the Too Faced Melted Matte Liquid Lipstick in Jawbreaker. Yeah, I don't usually go for such bold lip colors, but I really liked how this one looked. Now I'm setting my face with the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. And then I'm going to go in with highlighter one more time. And then I'm going to set my face with the Urban Decay D Slick Makeup Setting Spray this time. And this is the finished look. You are so beautiful. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in my next video.